Hi there, my name is Kendrick and welcome to Travel and Live Free. In this video, I'm gonna talk about how Scotia Rewards has now become Scene Plus and that video is gonna come up right now. After I came back home from my recent trip abroad, I looked into my Scene Points balance and I was surprised to see why I have so much scene points all of a sudden. I was gonna watch Spider-Man No Way Home and I wanted to check to see how much scene points I have to see if I can make any redemption. And turns out I had tons of points, but I got a little bit suspicious. So later on when I checked my Scotia Rewards account, there was no Scotia Rewards account. I couldn't find it. It kept taking me to the Scene Plus website and I was thinking to myself, is there something wrong here? But after doing a little bit of research, turns out Scotia Rewards and Scene Plus are now the same thing. So basically the reason why I had so much scene points was because my Scotia reward points have become scene points. So thank God I didn't redeem those points to go watch a movie, and instead I'm saving them up to one day go on an over the water bungalow and use those points to pay for the seaplane that costs about 900 US dollars. In terms of changes, there's not actually a lot of changes except for the interface of the website. So for every 1,000 scene points, you can redeem $10 towards travel. Now you do need to have the whole amount of points to make a redemption. So if I wanna redeem 900 US dollars worth of travel points, then I'm looking to make sure that I at least have around 1,200 scene plus points in order to do that. Now, in terms of major changes from the previous Scotia Rewards program, well before, if you wanted to redeem your points and you have two credit cards that has Scotia Rewards, which is a Scotia Bank American Express Gold or the Scotia Bank Passport Visa, then you would have to transfer the points between both credit cards. However, because of the new changes, the points are automatically pulled into the same account, so you don't have to transfer points between both credit cards anymore. They simply automatically get transferred after you've earned those points. I have yet to redeem my points yet with the new Scene Plus program, but I will get a chance to do so this coming May when I travel to the Maldives and have to pay that $900 US for that seaplane. So, Hopefully I get enough points to pull that off because as of now I don't have enough points so I do have to earn more points before I can make that redemption. Anyways, that's about it for this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave your comments below and don't forget to sign up to our Travel and Live Free newsletter where you can get a test of cheat sheet on how to travel around the world. You'll also get the latest tips and strategies on how to save money on travel for Canadians, how to go on around the world adventure travel for Canadians and how to use travel to get more freedom in your life as a Canadian. You can sign up for that newsletter in the description below. Until next time, I'll see you then.